Sunday. There will be vendors and intermission performances. So make sure you head on over to Ticketmaster.ca to secure your seats and we hope to see you there. All right, fans, it's now time to get up off your feet and shake it off on our dance camp. Boys, take it away. Come on, let's dance. Celine, 33 goals on the season, which ranks you number four in the league. What's been the biggest factor of production this season? Since the trade, the Leafs are also number one in face-offs at 58.4%, with O'Reilly leading, winning 69.8% of his draws. The depth on this team is remarkable at the moment. What's going on, everyone? Sleech Market with Bet99, and we're back at Maple Leaf Square. Round two, game two, Leafs, Panthers, let's go. Are we clinching tonight? Of course we are. Who's going first? Justin Hall. <laughs> They're gonna think you're just a weirdo. I know, they know too much. Celine, weirdo. you ruined my cool Maybe you facade. have to bring your son with you, so it's not <laughs> it's too hot. It's his. At each OHL home game, a lucky winner will have an opportunity to score four passes to the Hockey Hall of Fame, located in Toronto, where over 65,000 square feet of interactive games and hockey's greatest artifacts await you. I'm here with the Foo Family Afternoons Hockey Hall of Fame winners. Congratulations! Must-see game right now is going to be Saturday when the Edmonton Oilers come to town to take on the Toronto Maple Leafs. Now, it's kind of like a revenge game. I mean, the Leafs just lost 5-2 to two against Connor McDavid and the Oilers not too long ago. Their offense was shut down. Welcome back to the Paramount Fine Food Center. Your Mississauga Steelheads open their back-to-back -back weekend against the Oshawa Generals. Now the Steelheads are looking for revenge as they fell 6-3 to three last meeting. Now I know all eyes are on James Hardy. He's setting records and he's breaking records. But all eyes need to be glued to Xander Vecchia as well. He's put up 43 points in 65 games for the Trout, coming off great performances. Now this weekend is the final regular season games before the playoffs begin next week. Puck drop is at 7 p.m. You were on the ice on Friday night when they honored Boria Salming, a fellow Swede. How special was that moment for you? But here's the thing. The Leafs are 5-8 and eight against bottom teams this year. Cough Arizona, cough Anaheim, cough Columbus, and cough Montreal. The odds are just way too good to pass up, so give me Chicago on the money line. All right, fans, it's now time for our shoot to center game. We have four contestants in each corner of the ice. The objective of the game is to shoot their puck to center ice, and whoever is the closest gets to go home with tickets to tomorrow's game. So we're gonna start in this corner over here. Who had the better game day fits? Uh, Ty. Ty? Do I have to? Do I have to pick one? If you have to. Yeah, Your I'll, life I'll, depends on it. I'll say myself. <laughs> of course. You are in for a head-to-head -head matchup between your Mississauga Steelers and the Guelph Storm. Now, the last time the Steelers weren't as successful, but this time we have all of you to cheer on the trout. So how loud can you be? Come on, you can do better than that. It's been three years since we've had a school day game. How loud can you be? Awesome, puck drops at 11 a.m.